Sometimes you might need to hide an element on the page for testing or comparison purposes. Usually this is done with a combo class. In my case, for example, a hide class, which sets a CSS effect of display none. And this makes it look like the element is no longer present here on the page in the layout. However, it is still in your Webflow project, so we can make it visible later again, which is good. But it's important to know that this element is still present in the code and can be crawled by search engines. And you might not want this. So a useful different approach is to go into the settings and then set the visibility to hidden. And the cool thing is that it's still present here in Webflow. And this icon shows that it's hidden, but it won't be rendered in the code on the live site, which has significant advantages. So you don't have to use the visibility settings only for components or CMS related elements. You can also use them to hide elements in general.